This is all of my investments. If everybody can stop for a moment and subscribe to the channel, I'd appreciate it. Uh, first stock today, NAKD. Oh, this is a reverse split. Uh, so that's why it, it, that's why it looks this way. It'll they'll they'll eventually. Do it. But, uh, all right. So next stock on the list is BVXV. Hello, hello. Uh, COVID good catalyst. Uh, so this one started out looking wonderful. It, uh, at a, uh, a higher high, lower high, you know, low, lower high, but then it didn't, it sort of, you know, flicked us out here and it rolled over, you know, and it just never really recovered after that, you know, it just it couldn't hold VWAP and just sort of hung around all day. Yeah, so. Yeah. SEAC, uh, this one, they've got halted pre market. Uh, they're talking about a, re a reverse merger. The I think they're supposed to be. Okay, they're supposed to be getting listed on the Nasdaq. Or they're talking about it. Make sure I'm telling everybody right. Change deal too. Well, anyway, I have my notes that I, that I wrote down. I'm not, not flying to the article right now, but um, yeah, I didn't really do any do much after the open here, as, as everybody can tell. Yeah, just sort of, you know, made a couple, you know, two, three tries trying to trying to get hold up up over VWAP, just couldn't do it. So. BRTX, they had, if you go back to, like the after hours, it's not perfect, but you, uh, you could almost sort of call this a double top, I'd, I'd say. Of course, it didn't, uh, we didn't get up there, so, yeah, of course, it did, uh, you know, pulled back quite a bit at the open, yeah, so, uh. Okay, ACST, they announced a $6 price target, so I mean, you know, I don't normally, I, t I take, you know, small cap price targets with a grain of salt, however, this is such a high price target that, it, you know, it, makes, you know, it, 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 it did make a move, so um, I don't know, maybe in the future we'll see it, you know, at least maybe try and get back up to the 200 moving average here, it's just about 281, but uh yeah, still I a mean, really, really nice, uh, nice activity, you know, going up into the, up until the afternoon, and it started to drop off. You even, you even had a nice bounce off of VWAP here. Yeah, pretty, pretty nice for us. Such a low price stock. I wasn't seeing any news on um, AVCT. I think uh, yesterday, uh, something with some kind of COVID catalyst with President Biden. Well, I believe that's what that's what it, what all the action's about here. So, something the president said. So, it, you know, hit a high pre-market of two seventy nine, you know, and then it didn't uh, didn't really start to do anything until later on in the afternoon. That's ABCT. Yeah. So the only other one, RCAT, they announced a $90 million contract with um, uh, Customs and Border Protection. So, you know, wonderful if you, you know, if you were, you know, if you had a broker to let you trade, you, you know, or like, a, like six in the morning. So, uh, yeah, made a nice, nice move here. Uh, break of VWAP. You know, of course, it, you know, it couldn't hold, but it was still, 
you know, I, I find this to be a little forgiving. Like, you know, get, to give people a little bit of a chance to get out. You know, and then even when I did come back to VWAP, it did, you know, pop up once more there before pulling the rug out. So, yeah, guys, that's all I have today. Uh, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. And, uh, yeah, see you guys back at it tomorrow morning. Uh, thank you, everybody.